Holy sh**. Chat. I cannot believe what has transpired in Melty Blood. That shit still baffles me. Dude, here is the rundown. We are getting two, count them, two Fade Go characters. What in the hell, dude? Dude, look at this shit. The Count of Monte Cristo, aka Edmund Dantes. If you guys play Fade Go, this character was essentially like the guy that was in Fade Go that was drawn by the same artist of Danganronpa. I didn't get him, but I always thought his design looked really cool. And then Ushi. I was not expecting Ushi. Dude, I wasn't expecting neither of these. These are two wild, wild characters that came out of nowhere. Now, here's the thing. There's like a big divide right now. And I understand both sides, all right? Melty Blood is Melty Blood. Fade Go is Fade Go. It was nice to have Saber, maybe Mash, but two Fade Go characters additionally to the two existing ones. This is basically a Fade Go fighter right now. This is like Melty Blood cross Fade Go. And I'm not gonna lie, as a fan of Fade Go that no longer plays Fade Go, I'm pretty happy. I, I, I sympathize though with the Melty Blood and the Tsukihime fandom. There's a lot of characters still that are missing and they keep releasing these Fade Go characters. I, dude, I, I, I'm kind of happy. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I, I am for this, you know what I mean? So with that being said, let me watch Ushi's trailer because I did not expect Ushi of all characters to get into this game from Fade Go. I was thinking Archer, maybe Lancer, possibly even like, I don't know, somebody else from the Fade Go that it's a little bit more prominent. This character does play a pretty big role in the Babylon anime, so that makes sense. But Edmund Dantes, I don't know if he shows up in there or if he shows up in another movie that's coming up. I'm surprised that there's two Fade Go characters primarily out of anything else. <laughs> boy, oh boy, she looks good though. <laughs> I like the sword though. I can't. Oh god, dude. All right, she looks really cool. I'm already, dude. I don't even have to. I don't even have to see much. I know what I like, and my neurons are definitely activated. All right. Oh yeah. And it's available December fifteenth. And the best part is, it's free that shit is crazy edmund dantes let me see this guy's trailer because i have seen the moves in fade go and it seems like he's got like weird dark beams and all sorts of weird moves that i did not expect edmund dantes to have you know i've seen the count of monte cristo one of my favorite movies of all time one of my favorite ip stories in general it's a revenge story super dope super sick i was not expecting them to adapt edmund dantes and the way they did in fade go so <laughs> Edmond Dantes. Wait a minute, is this freaking... What's uh, the, the popular voice actor? One that does Eren. Oh shit. Okay, that's, that's cool. It's got like dark matter coming out of him. Ooh, that seems like a Rekka of some kind. Ooh. Uses his fists and stuff. It's kind of cool. Damn, he has got a Kamehameha. Alright, he looks sick. Yep. They did these characters justice. They did. I just feel bad for the Tsukihime fandom. Even though, like, I'm very happy with this outcome. Yeah, this is definitely more of a marketing ploy. I feel like so you can get more eyes on Melty Blood. Mash worked. Saber Mr. definitely Stringer worked. Going to speak. More people have eyes on t uh, Melty Blood than than before. That's for damn sure. I'm pretty sure as soon as they decide, they sit down in that board meeting and they're like, "All right, boys, it's time for Gil. It's time for the boy." I think that's when everyone will come together in unison. I don't know if it'll be as united as I think they're gonna be, but I feel like Gil is a cool character, cool enough character to have people be like from all communities be like yeah that's a good choice <laughs> will i be playing them yes i do want to play them i don't know if i'll have time i have to squeeze it into the schedule there's a couple things i want to do but i think i do have time for melty blood for sure the street fighter 6 beta is next week oh shit that's right i have to figure things out the beta and melty blood oh my god and the strive patch as well oh are you gonna play the new crisis core ff that's coming out next week too? Uh, 